Hey guys, what's going on? Time for some Streets of Rage. Who's ready? Max difficulty. Playing as Blaze. Uh, I've already done a playthrough as Adam, so we got to do Blaze next, and then we'll do Axel in the future. What's going on, guys? Who's already here? I, I, I kind of already know. I've been keeping up with the chat a little bit. I do like some last-minute preparations and stuff. Check uh, a couple of things right before the stream starts, and the uh, internet and all that stuff's good today. So, uh, look like we're gonna have a nice, good, long, cozy stream today. Well, not—I don't know about cozy, but it's gonna get it. rage. Will be happening later on with uh, Ghost and Goblins and Holy Diver, but uh, we'll see here. Uh, what's going on? Coffee Crudders. Blaze plays with a massive gift sub bomb there of 10, who I will call all out in just a second. Crudders, Booty, Rage Time Gaming, Bama. What is going on, guys? Good to see all of you. Hope everybody's had a nice Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday when I'm not able to stream. Hope everyone was doing great. I was working, <laughs> not having a whole lot of fun, but uh, that's life. Blaze, again, dude, thank you so much for these gift subs, too. Retrononymous, Raspy, uh, Bidalus, I'm sorry, I can't pronounce that. Uh, the, uh, Ren, Ethely, Rage Time Gaming, Clog Monster, Marty DeLorean, Panzer Lord, and G. Kel. If you're here and you got a sub from Blaze, please give him your thanks, because that was extraordinarily cool. Thank you for the resub as well, dude. Good to see everybody. Akashi's Challenge. I have not seen that. Sounds like something I'd probably be interested in, though. <laughs> you know I like challenges. Bomb ass stir fire. And remember that the NBA All Star game is coming to Cleveland. Well, I hope you get to go to it, man, because that'd be a lot of fun. That would be a blast. Hey, Ellie, welcome in as well. My goodness, I'm falling so far behind in the chat already, and we haven't even started the game yet. <laughs> I'm hyped for this as well. Crudas and Kane, thank you for the host. I really appreciate it. Yeah, my day is good because it's time to stream. I'm not working right now, so it's always a pleasure when I'm not having to work. Bama, welcome in, dude. Good to see you, man. Hope all is well. Ellie, hope you're having a good day. Ellie, that... Uh, that Kirby game you were playing last night, that looks awesome. I want to try that at some point. That's got to be on Super Nintendo. That looks awesome. Man, I, I'm, I'm excited to be here as well, guys. I am thrilled. Welcome in Magneto as well and Goober. I'm, I'm not going to miss anybody here. I'm making sure. I hate missing anything in my chat. All right, guys. Let's get started here. We'll do some shout outs for you guys when we get a few more people here in the chat. So more, so more people will see it. All right, let's get rolling with some Streets of Rage. Rage. All right, hardest difficulty. That's what we're doing. I don't it may take one or two try or may take a try or two to get through this. This is very difficult on this setting. Enemies can kill you extraordinarily fast. It's kind of crazy. All right, for some reason the host didn't work. The host pop up. I have no idea why. Oh, it looks like I'll have to fix that. Yeah, something's wrong with that. All right. Oh, who was that that just did the host? Thank you very much for it because it's not showing up on my end. Kirby Superstar on SNES. Let me make a note of that because I am not familiar with that, Ellie, and I would really like to try it, try it at some point in the future. I've never seen that before, before you started playing it. So that is Kirby Superstar. Kirby Superstar. And my host thing's still broken, so whoever that was, thank you very much. I've never played Metal Gear Solid. The only Metal Gear game I've played is on the NES, the original one that's so bad. And it pissed me off, and I never wanted to play another Metal Gear game in my life. That's how that went. I know I, I shouldn't look at it that way, but that game, I was not happy about it. Also, welcome in j Dog. Good to see you, man. What is going on? j Dog's going to get Tyson beat soon. I know it. Celestial, welcome in. Good to see you. How are you doing today? My goodness, we're busy, and I'm, I'm just now starting the game. 
Chaos Warrior, welcome in, dude. Good to see you as well. Hope you guys are having a wonderful whatever today is, Thursday. <laughs> Always lose track of the days in the middle of the week. Perfect Spade, welcome in, dude. Spade in the house playing some Castlevania 3. That's fun. Love Castlevania 3. Welcome in, Chris. Good to see you, dude. How are you doing today, man? Always a pleasure to see all you guys, man. <laughs> I think I've finally caught up with the chat now. Nope, Puddin's here. It'll say for as large and intimidating as this gang is, the lack of firearms for late 80s, 90s gang is disturbing. That's funny, Puddin. Not a single character in this game has a gun, do they? A guy brings out a boomerang, another guy brings out claws. But you have everything except a gun in this game, which is... Oh, never mind. Mr. X has a gun. That's right. But nobody else does. Like, not a single person in this game has a gun besides him. Puddin, how you doing today as well? Good to see you, dude. We're just getting underway here on our max difficulty attempt of Streets of Rage. I've already done it with Adam, so we gotta do it with the other two characters as well. So today's gonna be Blaze. Handy little stun lock that works pretty good here. I haven't played this in a while, so it's, I'm probably gonna be a bit rusty. It's like a long time ago when I last played this, but I did own this as a kid, so that's a good advantage. That is kind of cheap right there, but that's the way we're gonna have to do this. We want to stand any chance of getting through this game on max difficulty. Twitch is messed up for you today. Twitch has issues some days, doesn't it? It has issues. I was having some issues with it last night. My, my girlfriend always watches through the mobile app because she's at work right now. And the mobile app is just awful. It's a piece of junk. I'm going to get my coffee going, preparing for work and snow later. I'll take some snow. We have had no snow here, but of course I am in Alabama. So snow is like a figment of everyone's imagination here. All right, do we need to get this? Yeah. Like I said, guys, we will do some shout-outs for everybody in a little bit so we'll get a few more people here in the chat that'll see it. Everybody always shouts me out, it seems, in their channel, so I always like to do the same. Alright, pretty good start here. Nothing too threatening. Of course, this is a level 1. If I'm dying on level 1, it's a big problem. Now the thing with the max difficulty in this game is the regular enemies are not any more aggressive. It's just how much damage you take. I believe that's the entirety of the difficulty in this. I think there's more enemies to fight as well. I'm, I'm pretty sure. I think that's the whole thing with the difficulty in this game is that it's a cut, there's more enemy spawns in there. They do a lot more damage. The later bosses can kill you in two hits, so that's going to be a huge threat. Yeah, I, I like the music. The music in this game's great. There's a famous composer from Japan that did all the music in this series and a lot of other Sega games. I forgot his name, but he did a very nice job with this game. The moat button isn't working, and the scribe button isn't even available. What is Twitch's problem, Goober? That is weird. <laughs> that, that's some real issues right there. Of course, knowing how crappy Twitch can be with their support and stuff, I'm not really surprised. That's him. That's him, Celestial. That's correct. Thank you. Yes, he did a great job with the music in this series. Yeah, Twitch is always trying to do stuff that no one asks for. They're trying to give us features we don't want, but their their core features a lot of times are broken. It's, it's kind of ridiculous. All right, good old stun lock right there. Oh, come on. If I die on level one, we're starting over, by the way. I can't afford to die on level one. Yeah, did Revenge of Shinobi and Act Razor as well? That is correct. That is correct. You know, things are weird when you got a guy bringing a boomerang to a fight. <laughs> like this guy. Uh oh, that could be a problem. I'm gonna go ahead and use this. 
Yeah, none of the subscriptions are showing up right now in the chat. I have no idea what's going on with that. That is definitely a Twitch issue. There's something bad wrong with that. Okay, I, I can't die on level one. I, I just can't. Okay, here we go. Disaster averted. That If I'm dying to that boss, we're not getting too far. Act Razor has incredible music, man. That is some of the best tunes on the Super Nintendo. I can't wait to play through uh, Act Razor on the stream. I haven't played it in like 20 years. I would really like to play it and to get ready for Act Razor 2 as well. Pretty good start here. I usually get off to a bad start in most streams, but today we're this is going pretty well to begin with. My only complaint about Act Razor 2, I haven't really played it yet, but it doesn't have the simulation part, and I really like that. I really, 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 really like the simulation part in Act Razor 1. I can't believe they didn't include that. I'm shocked by that. Yeah, no birds in this game, thankfully. No birds in this game, but fear not, Coffee. Birds will return in Ghost and Goblins, which we'll be playing later. <laughs> So there'll be plenty of birds on level 2, which probably be stuck there for the whole rest of the Ghosts and Goblins portion of the stream. Not really looking forward to that. But it is what it is. Move on, see the subscribe option and full access to the emotes, which is odd because I used to have consistent issues with mobile. Yeah, the mobile version of Twitch is pretty terrible. I have all kinds of issues with it when I'm trying to like follow along. There's a 30 second delay or something too. It's insane. Well, I'll take those birds, Puddin, over the over the flying ones. I'll take I'll take those. <laughs> Anything but the flying ones. I'm forever tainted with birds thank, thanks to ghosts and goblins. Uh, there'll never be a happy moment with me and birds again. I'll, I'll, those are much better right there. <laughs> Alright, I'm leaving that apple in case this guy hits me or something, which doesn't look like it's gonna happen. Alright, I guess there's nothing here. I'm not picking up the bottle. That weapon sucks. That's one up. I need that. Don't whip me. I want to. There we go. Yeah, the Twitch mobile delay is terrible. It's at least 30 seconds. I try and follow along with people's streams from work when I'm on mobile sometimes, and I'm like, wow, this is it's just not working too well. <laughs> I can't really chat. A lot of times I'm just reduced to pure lurking, which is, which is still good. I mean, it supports people, but it sucks not being able to follow along from work a lot of times. I just sit there in silence and have to just, like, watch. Not exactly thrilling, but can't be helped because Twitch has not done a good job with that mobile app. Instead, they're providing content none of us wanted or asked for, like reasons people aren't subscribing to you anymore. I don't care about that. I don't think you guys do either, that feature where you can look in your stats and see why people aren't resubscribing or whatever. Nobody cares about that. I don't know. But that's the kind of stuff they give us. Hey, that's working pretty good. We haven't died yet, and this is on the hardest difficulty. I'm not going to complain. Yeah, the delay only seems to... Oh, is it just iPhone? If it's just iPhone, that... That explains uh, a lot, because I've only ever had iPhones before. Hey, Ren! Welcome in, dude! Ren, how's it going today, man? Nice job on Holy Diver yesterday. Outstanding job finishing up. And then you're like a literal god at NES Open Golf. I was like, god, dude, we're watching a freaking professional here. <laughs> Crazy stuff. Don't you throw... This is like the weirdest enemy in a beat-em-up ever. A guy juggling stuff? Who came up with that idea? That's like extremely weird. <laughs> oh, man. Darius Left Boot, welcome in. Good to see you as well. Always a pleasure. Hope you're having a great day. Yeah, Ren just beat Holy Diver a no-swear run, and you didn't have to buy any subs to chalk, did you? 
sure Chulk is like in disbelief about that, but it worked out nicely. That was a lot of fun. Let's get these guys in a nice fat stun lock. There we go. I'm really worried about the boss at the end of this level. It's the guy with the claws. He's probably going to take a life from me, but that's okay. We can afford to die a little bit here and there. I use Twitch on my Android all the time. Very few issues. It may just be an iPhone thing. That's possible. I've never used anything but an iPhone for a mobile phone. I, mean, I, I get familiar with something. I never want to switch. Right, that's a lot of enemies right there. Throwing, juggling axes and throwing them at me. That's absurd. I'll take that. That worked great. That worked great. Goten, what's up, man? Welcome in, Goten. Another holy diver. Streamer has entered the chat. All you guys that stream need to play some Holy Diver. <laughs> yeah, we're the iPhone gang, right? <laughs> I can't imagine using anything but iPhone. I don't like this guy at all. This guy is a big time asshole and he's probably going to kill me. Alright, good start there. I don't know what triggers this guy's attacks. He's kind of weird a good start to this fight, though. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and use this now. Uh, what's the story with the green screen? I don't use booty. Uh, I was trying to create, like, a green screen type thing, and I couldn't get it to work because the lighting in my room is terrible here. So it never worked out, and I just kind of abandoned the idea. Because this desk is set up like in the corner of a room, and it faces towards a little bit towards the middle. And the light is in the center of the ceiling, so I don't get much light back here in the corner. And I couldn't make the green screen idea work, so I just gave up on it completely. This was years ago. Uh, Puddin', I've never heard of that game. What type of game is that? <laughs> There's so many games I've never heard of. I rely on you guys to, like, let me know about games and stuff. Because I know practically nothing about gaming beyond the 90s. I know that's terrible, but I, I know very, very little. Yeah, Twitch is having major problems, Goten. I have no idea what's going on. There are the subs aren't showing up. People's uh, subscription buttons gone. There's all kinds of issues with Twitch today. I have no idea what's wrong with it. Yeah, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say it's just a, some type of Twitch problem that's causing all the nonsense. Now we can't even do shoutouts today. That's that really sucks. Hopefully that's going to be fixed. I have no idea. Is it just my channel doing all this stuff that's screwy or is it everybody? It's just my channel. I got major issues. <laughs> Nuttiest game you've ever played. You have a ball. Roll stuff up and make constellations. That sounds odd. <laughs> that sounds really odd. What the crap? <laughs> I did not mean to pick the apple up. That's okay. It doesn't look like it's going to hurt me. Okay, we're good. We're good. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with Twitch today. Something's bad wrong. And I don't know if it's fixable. That seems like it's a problem on Twitch's end, unfortunately. I really don't like weapons in this game. Their range is too short and they're too slow and clunky. I just want to get rid of that. There we go. I'm not picking that up. I don't want that either. I just don't trust it. Check Hatch's channel. The same thing. No emotes, no subscribe button. Yeah, Twitch is, Twitch is screwing us over right now then. Screwing us over. I'm not surprised. They're probably implementing a new feature no one asked for and it broke everything in the process. Who wants to bet? Dragon, welcome in, dude. And Lord Pookums, good to see you as well. 
everybody's having Twitch problems today. That sucks. I can't even do shout out for you guys. Oh, they're moving things around too, Ren? What in the world? What in the world? Yeah, all the sub badges are gone too. Hey, Victor, welcome in, dude. How you doing today, Victor? Good to see you as well, man. Figures they fix my internet and Twitch breaks. My internet's fixed, by the way, guys. I, I, I think. I'm not going to jinx it, but I think my internet's fixed. I had to call and complain for like the last month or so, and they finally fixed it. The guy kicked me and I took no damage. That was weird. We're keeping the food on the screen. That's the whole plan here. Trying to get rid of this guy. Gonna stun lock him. That was dumb. Yeah, if they're implementing animated emotes for everybody, Goten, I think we can tolerate Twitch being a little bit broken. But I bet they just screwed something up. Everything better come back soon. Okay, what's going on here? Dude, the time limit's about to run out. You know what, I'm going to have to use this because the time limit's about to run out and I'm going to lose life. I just realized the time limit. Hey, Cinny, what's going on, man? Welcome in. And Fozzie, good to see you as well. Welcome in, guys. Hope you guys are having a great day. Time limit's going to run out and we're going to lose a life. That's fun. Let's see these guys die real quick. God damn it. What the hell, dude? Why is there a time limit that strict in a beat em up? Okay, well, that's our first death. So stupid. Hey, Johnson, welcome in as well, dude. And now, look, the time limit refreshes 13 seconds later. We were 13 seconds too slow in that spot. That sucks. All right, so what, what's the plan here? Do more damage faster, kill stuff quicker. All right. Mission accepted. What is Cine, what game is that? Is that a Famicom game? You still doing Famicom? Is that the uh, Famicom Castlevania 3? Yeah, January's not my month, Dragon, that's for sure. The only thing that's, that's working in my favor in January is the nice cold weather. It's like it's 37 today, that's nice. I love that. I know a lot of you guys don't like cold weather. I love it. Uh-oh, we got a boss here. We got the ultimate warrior. That is definitely the ultimate warrior. For you guys that knew wrestling from back from the 90s and stuff, that's totally him. <laughs> Japanese version was painful. I'd like to play through it at some point, Cindy. I'd like to play through it just to, like see the differences between the U.S. release and the Japanese one. I really would. Wow, that goes all my health. Let's see if we can kill this guy without losing a life. Alright, got him. Got him. No life loss except for the idiotic time limit run out. Yeah, what is up with the time limit being that short, Puddin? That's ridiculous. It's a beat-em-up. Why is, do we have a strict time limit? Okay, so one death so far, and it's because of the time limit running out. That's just absurd. I'm, I can't get over that. Have to kill stuff a lot faster. Yeah, I want to try the Japanese Castlevania 3. Spade's working on the U.S. version. He's on the Cypher path right now, and he's on some of the worst levels, too. The later levels suck. Big time. What am I missing in the chat here? Hold up one second. Did the Ultimate Warrior become Sting or I'm stupid? I don't think he did. I, I think Sting was someone else. I could be wrong, though. <laughs> I could be wrong. I did follow wrestling a little bit, like in the late 80s, early 90s when I was a kid, but beyond that time period, I know, like, nothing about it. Like, the, the current era and stuff, I don't know who's who. I don't have a clue. 
Dragon, thank you for the bits, dude. I appreciate it. I guess bits are working. Blaze uh, gifted out 10 subs earlier, so the get his gift sub was working. You can't throw me. I can land on the throw, buddy. You can't throw me. All right, she's down. Yeah, that's him, the ultimate warrior. For, for, yeah, Bama knows who it is. He knows. That was like the most ster uh, steroid-fueled wrestler ever of the late 80s. Dude was just jacked. He died earlier due to all those roids, too. That is unfortunate. Dude, the music in this game, Sinny, is awesome. It is absolutely awesome. Some of the better music on the Genesis. Pretty good run here. Sting with someone else and he sang with the police before he we went solo. <laughs> Oh, yes, I'd forgotten about that. I don't think there's any difference in Bare Knuckle 1 and 2 with Streets of Rage 1 and 2, Cinny. I think they're the same. I know Streets of Rage 3 and Bare Knuckle 3 are very different. Uh, Streets of Rage 3 is much harder. It was to combat the rental industry problem we have here in the United States, or what they perceived as a problem. They didn't want us renting games. They wanted us to buy them. If we can knock people in the hole here, that would be great. All right, perfect. I don't know how you throw the... There we go. I was about to say, how do you throw the knife in this one? I don't remember. All right, see ya. See if we can drop this woman down the hole, too. There we go. Perfect! We need more of that. careful with this part old school wrestlers put their bodies through hell they did dude they did they did in Hulk Hogan still active in wrestling or something crazy like that I could be wrong could be wrong but I think he's still doing stuff there we go oh gotta be careful these guys can throw you so you don't want to move down where that traffic cone is you don't want to be down there they'll just throw you off Yeah, Macho Man did those Slim Jim commercials forever. He did. Go ten. Yeah, Bret Hart was the Hart Foundation was awesome. I like the Hart Foundation. That was one of my favorite tag teams back in the day. Do they even still do tag teams in wrestling? I have no clue. That is a one up, and we need that. Six lives, guys. This is a good run. Oh, I was about to say, is this guy gonna just jump off the ledge? That'd be nice. Oh, that's right, Chuck. That's right. Hogan had that issue. I forgot about that. That's right. He's blacklisted. There was uh, another tag team I remember I liked back in the day. The Rockers, Shawn Michaels and Marty Jannetty. And everybody was like, uh, this is a, everybody liked that tag team. But then Shawn Michaels went solo and had like one of the best careers ever. And everybody was like shocked about that. He came from such like humble beginnings. Don't like the positioning here. There we go. I knew that was gonna happen. Oh my god, we can't take hits, man. This is not going well. We can't afford to take too many hits. I have very little health to work with in this difficulty. Alright, we got him. A lot of damage there from just like three hits. Hey, Tony Uncle Al, what's up, man? How are you doing today, dude? Make sure I'm not missing anybody coming in here. I think I, I want to say I missed somebody coming in. Oh, I think I'm good. All right. I think I'm good. Oh, the time limit. It was at one second again. I got to fight stuff faster. This is a big problem. This is a huge issue here. This is not good. I really need to get that. I need to get the chicken. Alright. This is getting scary, man. <laughs> There's a lot of enemies here. Still 
only died once. This is a good run. I'm not going to jinx it. Oh, the Road Warriors. Pretty much the best tag team ever. How could I forget the Road Warriors? Yeah, they were, they were pretty much the top, top of the line. Total top of the line stuff there. Better than the Heart Foundation. Better than Demolition. Any other tag team you can think of. Dude, I miss that, that era of wrestling. I really do. It was cool. Whoa! That was a big chunk out of my health. So was that. Okay. That was not good. That was even... Wow. Throg, welcome in, dude. What's going on, man? Good to see you, dude. I, I, I would do shout-outs for you guys, but unfortunately, the bot isn't working because there's something going on with Twitch right now. I have no idea what it is. It's just not working. Having a DeGorno Self Rising Crust Supreme Pizza. Those are pretty good for frozen pizzas, aren't they? Those aren't bad. Just chilling, Tony. That sounds good, man. I'm doing the same. All right, I don't know if like extra enemies spawn with this guy or not, but we're just gonna go ahead and drop them. WrestleMania four. I think I remember three and six the most as a kid. All right, let's see if we can. Damn it! I knew that was gonna happen. I knew it. The boss fights are not bad in this game. It's just the little, little extra guys that cause a problem during the boss fights. Like this little idiot right here. All right, I should not have thrown him over there. All right, we got him. Had to die again, but that's okay. That's okay. We've got six lives and no continues use we're on level five so it's going good it's going good what happened to ultima ghosts and goblins goober i'm in the process of making a list of what we have to do in ultimate ghosts and goblins because it is very complex the next steps we have to take in that game and it is a it's a process way more so than i was expecting so expect Ultimate Ghosts and Goblins to return either Saturday or Sunday when I have more time to create the list I'm working on. There, You won't believe how much crap you have to set up in that game to even make any more progress from where we are. It's nuts. It is totally nuts. Top, top favorite wrestlers of all time. Hulk Hogan and the Ultimate Warrior. Whenever I played WF Tag Team Games, that's who you got. Yeah, Magneto, wasn't that funny? Because in WrestleMania 6, it was all hyped up for Hulk and Ultimate Warrior. And it turned out to kind of live up to the hype with that wrestling match there. It was a good one. A lot of the hype never matched it. That was a really good match in WrestleMania 6. I was looking forward to that as a kid. Hey, Insomniosis, welcome in, dude. I hate that their little minions start showing up after the first boss. Dude, me too. That ruins a lot of the fights. Just totally ruins them. I'm worried about the Mr. X fight late in the game if we make it that far because the little guys just continually show up and they will screw that fight over, I remember. I had a hard time doing that with Adam when I was playing. All right, we got a bunch of guys running at me with knives. Not going well. <laughs> and maybe there's a way to get health back. I w games were just simple and fun back in the day, at least. Right? <laughs> That's why I still stick with old games. It, I'm, some new games I've looked at before, the complexity levels, is it's, it's just a little bit too much for me. I just want to like pop a game in and play it. You can't do that with a lot of modern games, unfortunately. Okay, I don't want to pick the knife up. Don't get the knife. This is not Ghost and Goblin. You don't want the knife. Walrenium, how's it going, man? Uh, we're, I think we're off to a pretty good start with Streets of Rage here. We've died a couple of times, but this is max difficulty, so I can't complain about a couple of deaths here and there. We're getting there. Slowly, but... Sh uh oh You know what? I'm going to go ahead and use this. <laughs> Use it or lose it. This gets refreshed if you die, so I would feel safer about killing all these guys with it than trying to fight them. There we go. 
probably wouldn't have enough time to kill that many guys anyway before the clock ran out again. Yeah, no DLC. I'm not a fan of DLC because the way they do DLC in games today. They, they cheat you. They, they uh, cut the game in half and sell the rest of it as DLC. And I, I'm not a fan. Okay, you're not going to get me, are you? No. Okay, good. I did not want to grab her. That was a mistake. Alright, another one down. Nope, god, microtransactions piss me off, man. I don't ever want to hear that word again. That's just a bad word all the way around. <laughs> Play max difficulty is max on Streets of Rage 2. I'd like to try it in Somniosis. I've done a playthrough on max difficulty with the Axel, but that's like easy mode. You can just spam the grand upper all day with the other characters. You actually have to do stuff. So I'll try it at some point. Yeah, the real police on the rocket launcher, not yet. Yeah, these these police are, are packing some good stuff here. <laughs> Got a napalm launcher, and if you have player two here, it drops like rock. They drop rocket powered grenades or something. Yeah, we'll do every game in Streets of Rage. I haven't played. I have no experience with three. I owned one and two as a kid, but three, I have no experience. So that'll be a brand new process. Of learning that game, and I know that's the hardest. That'll be a thing. Hey, Fabled Games, welcome in, dude. Sorry if I missed you coming in earlier. Hope you're having a good day as well, man. Good to see you as always. All right, now we can pick this up. This is a little over halfway through the game. So I think we're in good shape as far as lives and stuff. Sub emotes are gone. See my follower and sub emotes. Oh my god, what have they done? What have they done? Okay. This is a bit of a scary fight here, but I think we're gonna be okay. Alright, they're all down. It better be. It's probably just Twitch screwing up. That's probably what it is. It's not uh, anything good. Oh, come on. I knew he was going to get me there. Okay, well, I still have, like, a little bit of health. <laughs> is that going to be... Oh, my God. We got to get that. Yes, that's a big deal. Just practically save the life with that. Yes. Everybody needs their animated emotes now. Oh, crap. Uh-oh. There's the ultimate warrior again. Dead. Didn't do that right. Did not do that correctly. This is what I was trying to do. That was a death we didn't need to take. That was a death we did not need to take. That's the kind of stuff that can end the run. Yeah, Twitch, Walrenium, Twitch breaks things and then tries to implement things no one asked for. We were talking about that earlier. No one cares why people aren't resubbing to your channel. And they, they added that as a feature. I've never even looked at it. I don't even know if it's live or not. I don't care. But that's the kind of crap they're trying to cram down our throats that no one cares about and nobody wants. Alright, that was good. That was good, alright. Exactly, Insomniosis. Who cares? Who cares about people, why people aren't resubbing? I don't want to know. 
That's something for mega streamers to look at or something. People with thousands of subs, I guess. Us, us, us small guys often get forgotten by Twitch, and that's just that's just the way it goes, unfortunately. It's beyond time for everyone to get their animated emotes, I know that. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> that was... They did hit me once, but I think that would be a good spot to use this. It's gonna kill all those guys, alright. There's a way to get health back. Just gotta one-up from get points. Never even look at why people subscribe, or is it... It's, I think it's not subscribe coffee. I, I think. And I... It's honestly none of my business why people don't want to subscribe anymore if, they, if they're not. That I'm, I'm totally cool with it. That's not a feature that should have been put in. Jesus Christ! Come on, we can't get killed by those guys. Yeah, points do give one-ups at least in this. That is, that's a massive positive. Yeah, we're about to fight the two Blaze clones. I'm going to probably lose a couple of lives against them, more than likely. I do know how to fight them, but that doesn't really mean anything. Probably going to be health back. Really? Look at the inconsistencies in damage in this game, guys. The guy threw a knife in my back and it barely hurt me, but a, a guy punching me does just as much or more damage. the range on that punch. Alright, I'm gonna throw this guy over here. Hey, Big Dave, welcome in, dude. How's it going, man? Good to see you. Hope you're having a great Thursday. Taking damage that I don't need to be taking. I think we should go ahead and pick this up. Yeah, Goten, I don't understand that at all, man. I have no idea why. I got follower, I got uh, my follower emotes when I didn't wasn't even active streaming. It was ridiculous. It's like it's total RNG randomness. I have no idea what they were thinking with that stuff. Alright, so for this boss, you want to use the, the backwards strike move, which is C and B together. One of them will always just walk towards you like that, and they'll just walk right into your kick every single time. Let's we'll see if we can beat these without taking a hit. That'd be cool. I don't see it happening. Of course not. Why would that happen? Okay, now we're trying to beat them without dying. That's not gonna happen either. Hmm, not good. Okay, wow, that sucks. Lives are starting to melt away a little bit. We're starting to lose lives. Uh, no, I don't know about a trick here. Twins will only go after Blaze and ignore Axel or Adam. That's really weird. I did not know that was a thing. <laughs> oh, that feels bad, man, right there. It feels terrible when you clear a level with max health. See, we basically died there and didn't need to die. I'm probably not going to get a one-up because we just got one from points. Ugh, this run's getting ugly. Uh, Mona and Lisa. One of my cats is named Mona. Is that really their names here? Mona and Lisa? That's cool. I had no idea. Not surprised though. That's the kind of like translations they did. Or do not resist to subscribe because of all the not bad quality content you don't not do. <laughs> I appreciate it, Coffee. I appreciate it. I'm just, I'm surprised anyone ever subs or give bits here. I really am. Because I, honestly, I would be streaming and having fun regardless of whether there was subs or bits at all. If the, even if that didn't exist on the platform, I'd still have a good, t have a great time streaming. I have no ambitions to become like a career streamer or anything, but I mean, if, if that happened, I'm great, but if not, I don't care. I'm, I'm happy where I'm at, that's for sure. Oh, nice hitbox. 
Nice hitbox. Still no animated emotes. Well, they have 10 days left before the end of the month. So then you can start complaining. <laughs> Couple of months of spring and you can't wait. I, I'm not looking forward to spring because I don't like warm weather. I like it cold. And here in Alabama, it almost never gets cold. So the, the heat and humidity will be back here very soon. So I like every day it's cold. I I like cherish. <laughs> don't you dare hit me. I knew you were going to hit me. I knew it. Okay. You can't attack at angles in this game. That's an issue with a lot of retro games. The enemy's attacking you at an angle. There's not much you can do about it. All right, took a couple of hits there that we didn't need to take. Pretty much par for the course. Hey, Jay Cox, what's up, dude? Welcome in. Congratulations on defeating Super Ghouls and Ghosts for the first time ever. Well played. That is a difficult game to play from scratch. Lots of learning has to be done, and you did very, 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 very well with that. Yeah, there's still people missing animated emotes, and I'm, I'm, I, I hate to see that because it's past time for everybody to get them. I got mine early on. I wasn't even thinking about it. I just checked one day, and I was like, "Oh, there's my animated emotes." <laughs> You hold up and C, by the way. You can, if an enemy throws you, you can get out of it by pressing up and C when you're in the air. It works really good, like that. I think these guys would give up on that idea after trying it a couple of times. Yeah, it's about the community, exactly. That's the whole thing with me. Career streamers that don't even follow their chat and stuff. I mean, I mean, they're making a living off Twitch, but it doesn't look like they're having much fun because they're not able to interact with anybody. That's just the way I see it. Okay, we know how to beat this guy like this. I think that guy would have killed me if he'd hit me because you take so much damage on this difficulty. There we go. All right, now refresh the time limit. For God's sake, a time limit to beat him up. Why? have to pick that up now? That's a waste. That is a bit of a waste there. Exactly, Bama. I'm glad you feel that way. I'm really glad you feel that way. Most people here in Alabama hate the cold weather. I love it. I actually can get outside and do stuff without sweating. When July rolls around, you walk to the mailbox You'll be and walk back inside, you'll be sweating. I'm, I'm not a fan been that way, I know, we've been that way our whole lives, but it, it, it doesn't matter, it doesn't mean we have to like it. <laughs> Alright, this run's starting to get a little bit better here, because we haven't died at any point on this stage, and that's a good thing. Alabama takes coaching from neighboring states, that's true as well. It is true. If I couldn't follow along with you guys in the Twitch chat at all, like if I had like 500 viewers or whatever, I don't know, I don't keep up with bigger streamers, but it, it would stop feeling like having fun, like chilling with a community, and it'd feel just like more like a job. <laughs> I mean, it'd still be a good job playing games for a living, but I mean, 90% of the fun I have on Twitch is like chilling with you guys, seeing what you guys are up to, hanging out in your channels. I mean, there's so much good to say about the small streamer communities and that gets lost when channels get too big so if my channel ever gets that big I apologize in advance for not being able to keep up with it but at least you guys could still message me off stream and stuff that would be good that would be excellent simply existing in hot weather is enough to make me melt yep you, this is not the state for you then you need to stay up there in Wisconsin and somniosis that's where I should be too Yeah, that's the thing, Fable. The animated emotes just went out completely randomly. Twitch didn't seem to care who got them and who didn't. There's people that deserved them way more than I did, too. Sub badges are coming back. They are. Is Nick Saban the unofficial governor of Alabama? Jaycox, I wish. 
dude's got a lot of common sense. He'd be a, he'd be a good politician, honestly. <laughs> Compared to the crap we usually have to put up with, I, I would take him as governor in a heartbeat. I don't like this positioning. I know I keep saying that, but the enemies keep like boxing me in spots I don't want to be in. All right, that crusher will help me out a little bit there. Some stun lock. There we go. All right, moving on once again. The, the, the boss of this level is terrible, by the way. It's two of those claw guys. So we're probably gonna lose uh, a couple of lives. Probability for you to have a serial killer in the audience increases with every new viewer. That's true, but at least it's the retro gaming community. Now, if this was I was streaming Team Fortress, I would be legit worried because I was getting death threats playing that game. <laughs> Thankfully, those days are over. Never again. Yeah, Jay Cox, that's what I would be so concerned about. Your channel grows too much. You can't interact with your chat anymore. You, they can't really interact with you because there's too many people spamming crap. That was my first experience on Twitch was watching some guy play Minecraft with 30,000 viewers. And I didn't know what was going on because no one was talking. They were spamming memes and the, the streamer wasn't even... Uh, he wasn't even interacting with anyone. And I was like, why are people watching this? I didn't get it. Alright, I want all of you enemies on that side. This is going well. I'm not, I'm not going to complain about it. Don't you throw me into the crusher. I know you want to try it. Hey, I'll run for governor. Why not? <laughs> why the hell not? Uh, you got to be... You gotta be a dishonest crook to be a politician. I don't, I don't think I could do it. <laughs> I don't think I could just lie my way through everything. I, I would just not feel good about it. Alright, let's bait that. There we go. Right, these guys stun locked. Stun locked. Just like that. Perfect. Saving like Bear Bryant is viewed as God by so many. Practically, they are they they are looked at that way, Bama, a lot. They are. Of course, we lose one game and people start questioning everything. Like the national title game got beat by Georgia and people are questioning the moves Saban made. Hey, we got beat. It happens. Some of these unrealistic fans need to like get a life or something. Life moves on. We'll, we'll come back next year. We'll try again. People acting like it's the end of the damn world when you lose a football game. My God. That better be food or something because I'm almost dead. Perfect. I'm going to go ahead and get it. What? That's right, coffee. Ghosts and goblins and all that crap for ev for for everyone. More holy diver. That's that, that's that's the kind of stuff I do as governor. Not any of this political bullshit. Nobody cares about. <laughs> that's how we're gonna roll. Oh, don't you hit me! I saw that. Believe that because of all the hot tubs and political bullshit then I found retro yep I was not in my happy place on twitch either until I found retro and this is where I will stay forever and I hope you guys hang around for a long time as well not just my channel I like hanging out in other people's channels as well always a blast hot tub debate coming next <laughs> yeah throg we could try it and I get banned real quick <laughs> absolutely Rare would be more mixer speed, more combat and boss battles. And, uh, interestingly enough, Goober, I've done a full playthrough of Terraria on expert difficulty off stream. Had a blast. I know they've updated it more since I've last played it, but the last boss I fought against in Terraria was the Moon Lord, and that was really awesome. I liked it a lot. But yeah, that was a uh, a lot of fun. It's a great game. All right, that's one of those. If we kill both these guys without losing a life, I'm going to be in absolute shock here. Absolute shock. I, I knew that was going to happen. I don't know how to time that. All right, that's that's fine. We died once. I was expecting to die more. 
That would, would have been really cool to get through that without losing a life, but whatever. Good enough. Maybe we'll get a one-up here. Alabama's going to lose to Tennessee next year. Booty, don't count on it, man. Don't count on that. <laughs> I would not bet on that. We may have lost to Georgia, but I, I think we're going to beat Tennessee next year. That streak's going to end at some point. It's been a long one. What? Okay, there went half my health. Half my health just got obliterated. Okay, let's start throwing guys off the elevator. I don't want this knife. Can we get rid of this? Yes, okay. There we go. I'll never forget hearing Bo Jackson tell the story when he was being recruited in high school. Neighbors came to their house in Bessemer just to see and hold the phone. Bear Bryant called on. Holy crap. And then he didn't commit to Alabama. Must have been something shady going on with that. Auburn probably paid him under the table or something. Wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. Alright, we're gonna stun lock these guys and hope for the best. This cheapskate jumping down here is causing a problem. Most of them are dead, I think. We're going to have to use that special move in a second, because uh, it's use it or lose it with that. I'm not going to be happy if this guy throws me off the ledge. There we go. Yeah, all right, get rid of the knife. Don't want it. We have all our continues, guys, still. We have a good shot to beat this, but Mr. X is a tough fight. You need an indie channel on Twitch? They do, Pookums, because there's a lot of great indie games out there, and it's hard to find people playing them because of the way Twitch does their categories. I like the way they do retro. That's basically, we can play any retro game in this category, which is awesome. But, like, for people playing, I don't know, just like some random indie game, it has its own category, and it's hard to find people that are just doing those types of games. We are so close to dying here. I'm about to have to a special move, and that's okay. We'll use it at the top of the next level. Alabama's the most national championships by Division One school. Yeah, we have 18 now. That's pretty impressive. We're like the New York Yankees of college football. That would be a good description. We're going to go ahead and use this, by the way. From what I heard, so it would be more than 36. Yes. I think it is more than that in some houses, I think so. I think Alabama grows its players in special tubes, and we do get some freakish athletes here. We really do. Saban's a great recruiter. I want that guy thrown off. Good, there we go. She's gonna hit me with a whip. Oh, you tried! You tried and you failed, purple guy. You know, get wrecked. Okay. Now we got the toughest fight coming at the top here, so I'm probably going to lose another life here, but that's okay. It's been a good run. This is the last. Yep, yeah, this is the top. No, I did not. Oh my god, we got them all in a stun lock. Oh crap. This is bad. This is really bad right here. Are you kidding me? Are we going to get through this? Are we going to... No, we're not. There's too many guys. That's okay. <laughs> hey, I'm still going. I'm still going! Oh my god! So close! What is going on with all these subs? Oh my god, come on, guys. <laughs> Matty O'Shea is sub, dude. Matty, thank you so much, man. Matty is resub. Thank you very much, dude. Holy crap. And Matty's gifted a gift sub to Chris. Thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate it, man. Go Tens gift and a gift sub to Jaycox. Guys, we're getting out of control here. Oh no, don't, no, 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 don't do this stuff. Go Ten, thank you so much for gifting a gift sub to Jaycox. And Maddie again, thank you for the gift sub to Chris. Really appreciate it.
Really, really appreciate it. Did I ever go to Streets of Rage's online site when they were still around? No, unfortunately not, Insomniosis. I should have, because I've always been a fan of this series. I kind of got out of the whole console scene in like the late 90s, early 2000s completely. He went to Auburn because Alabama wouldn't let him play football and baseball. Well, it sounds like we should go back in time and fix that and let him play both, Bama, because we miss out on a generational athlete. That's really frustrating to me. Though I like Bo Jackson. I don't care if he didn't, uh, didn't go to Alabama. He's a good dude. Johnson with a... Uh, can I please have a gift sub? Well, sometimes they just you just get them randomly. Like when people give out random gift subs and stuff, Johnson, sometimes you'll get one. I, that happens to me and a lot of other people's channels as well. And Booty with a hundred... Matt, I'm sorry, Maddie with a hundred bits, dude. Scam train. No hype train. <laughs> Maddie, thank you for those hundred bits, man. I really appreciate it. Now look what you guys have done. You've done it again. Done it again. You've done a damn hype train that I didn't ask for. My goodness. Daria's left boot with a hundred bits. Here we go. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna just turn hype trains off completely. You guys are leaving me with no choice here. I just got run over by a table. Forgot about that. Whoops. But here we are on uh, level eight, guys. We got a, a real shot to do. And we're not gonna get a one CC. Don't even think about it. <laughs> I'm not thinking about it, and I'm lying. I am thinking about it, but it's not going to happen. Now, that'd be a challenge. One CC, hardest difficulty, Streets of Rage. Yeah, that would be tough. We're not going to get it, though, because there's a boss rush, and then there's Mr. X, which is a really tough fight. That's not going to happen. Yeah, that happens to me as well, Insomniosis. You just get random gift subs sometimes from channels you've never been to. I've got a bunch that way. I'm like, uh, who? I, I don't know this person. And I have a gift sub to their channel. I've never been in it before in my life. It's weird. Is Boomerang Guy going to come up? Nope, not yet. Yeah, the music track for this level is great. guys with knives have been a threat the whole game. Hey, retro fan, what's up, man? What's going on, dude? Hope you're having a great day. We are doing a little Streets of Rage here, and it's going well. We're on the last level on max difficulty, and we haven't even used continue yet. So it, it's a we're on a really good run here, better than I was expecting. pick this up now yeah we'll do another playthrough of this in the future with uh, uh the other guy axel that's who i was trying to think of we've done adam now we're doing blaze on max difficulty so still got to do axel in the future but that's cool looks like we're probably going to succeed here today chris with 50 bits dude thank you so much appreciate it man Red Dirt subs. Is he not stream anymore? Last broadcast was a year ago. Okay, that's what I was, I was thinking about something like that. Yeah. Go 10 with 100, bitch. You guys are far too kind, as always. Our community here on Twitch, not just my channel, but I see you guys in all kinds of channels. And you guys are just awesome. stream of Streets of Rage remake? Yeah, I probably would, Goober, because I like these. I like beat-em-ups. Grew up playing beat-em-ups, so yeah, that would definitely be right up my alley. Juggle Man is down. It's funny that the, uh, <laughs> celebrities have Twitch channels, and sometimes they use them. Not too often, but... Sometimes they do. If I was a celebrity and I was really rich, I'm not sure if I would bother with anything at all. If I was, if I had a, like millions of dollars, I think I would just disappear from the face of the planet and live in like a penthouse at the beach. And nobody would ever hear from me again. That, that's what I would do. I'd probably still stream though, just simply because I like it. <laughs> that's what I would be doing. They are providing way too much food here that I don't need. Alright, any more 
guys I can fight here? Guess not. Guess we have to pick it up now. Watch the damn time limit. That's killed me once already. Gary Cruz, Fred Durst, Sasha Gray, Thomas Middleditch, Jay Muse, T Pain, and more. That's that's amazing. That is amazing. I do not have Streets of Rage 4, but I need to get it because people have told me it's great. And then if you like the original Streets of Rages, then 4 is worth getting, and I don't have it yet, but should have bought it during the last Steam sale. I guess maybe next time. Rated Sean? That's awesome, Pookums. That's really cool. Getting a raid from somebody like that, that'd, that'd be like mind-boggling. Still don't know how to determine when this guy's gonna attack. Should be about dead. Okay, that worked great. Now about some health. We just beat a tough boss. Or a boss that had a chance to do a lot of damage to me. That's Pepper. That's useless. Look what Pepper does in this game. Well, I missed, but Pepper makes an enemy sneeze. That's like the dumbest thing ever for a beat em up. There's food on the floor. We're gonna get that. Got another one up. Guys, this is a great run. Pepper makes some dance, yeah. <laughs> Playing with a friend and we both died. Time out of nowhere. The time limits in these types of games is kind of pointless. I, I never understood that. All right, Mystical Fighter on Genesis. If you want a hard beat em up, okay. Let me jot that down, Cinny. Mystical Fighter. I don't think I've ever heard of that, but I will have a look at that off stream for sure. We even died yet on this level? I think I still don't think we've had one death on it yet. This is, run has gone way better than I deserve it to go. This is max difficulty too. No well, growing up with this game, I can't really can't really be surprised. Yeah, coffee, that's the thing. There's not an I don't have enough time. Oh, you cheapskate. It's taking lives from me every single time. That's twice now we've lost a life to this guy. That's garbage. have to get this guy into a pattern and I didn't do that. I'll just walk into your jump kick over and over, but until that happens, this I have to just take another death. This guy's a lot harder in Streets of Rage 2, by the way. They made him insane there. If you're not playing his axle with the grand upper, forget it. Lester the Unlikely is pretty good. You guys are saving up for that, I know. I'm, I'm dreading every second of it, but every second is a second closer to when you guys redeem Lester the Unlikely or Superman 64 or any of our other esteemed redemption choices. Oh, look, there's food right there. Love that game the way it smacks people. It's hilarious. Cindy, I may have seen you play that at some point. Like a couple of months ago or something. That, the name sounds a little bit familiar, maybe. What's funny is all you guys saving up points, you're all going to like bombard me at once with the redemptions. Because I, no one's redeemed anything yet, and I know you guys are saving points. So it, it's only a matter of time. Before we're playing some of the worst crap the retro video game world has to offer. I'm, I'm dreading it, but I, I fully expect it to happen. Okay, that went pretty well. A 
what in the hell was that? He's like stun locked me and I'm dead. Went from full health to just dead, like instantly. That's garbage. I didn't even get a chance to get the apple. This guy's dead now. That was garbage. I don't think I've ever seen that one, Insomniosis. That's another one. That'll be something else I have to look up. Sword of Sodan. I, I knew you guys were reading that one as well. And Superman 64. Everything's going to get redeemed at some point. And when you guys redeem stuff, I'll replace it with other games that... I can find that might be miserable to play through. Now, some games are so bad, I'm not going to play them at all. And I'll give you a good example. Uh, Back to the Future Parts 2 and 3. I'm not putting that up for 500,000 points. because That's like the worst video game of all time. I refuse. A, two, a, like, a thousand gift subs wouldn't be enough. Yeah, the music's awesome here, Booty. This is definitely the best track in this game. See if we can stun lock this guy to death. You can't use your special thing here with the police car, unfortunately. Don't you push me off the screen where I can't get that. Of course, everything works perfectly when, uh... When there's food on the screen, I never take it yet. But if there was no food here, they would kill me. I'd be dropped in no health. Alright. Nothing else to fight here. Not even gonna pick it up, there's no point. Stun locking time. Oh! oh you piece of garbage! Okay, there goes half my health again. We cannot let these guys hit me. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God, Chris. You've got a lot of points. It's going to be something. <laughs> of all the games on the list, I made Dark Castle the most expensive because I deemed it probably the worst game because I have no idea how to play it and don't really know anything about it. That's going to be miserable. Lester the Unlikely is playable. It might be more playable than some stuff. It really might be. <laughs> we'll see. It's more playable than Superman 64. I'll give it that. All right, got a bit of a tough fight here. They do walk into that back strike attack, which is very nice to have. I really don't want to be surrounded. Oh, what? I wasn't even looking. That's bullshit. How could I have done that any faster? You can't just jump in here and attack these characters that quickly. That's just stealing lives from me at this point. That's all that is. Well, now they're dead and I took no damage, of course. All right, we have all our lives and continues. So let's drop Mr. X here. Superman 64, the best game ever made. Oh boy. <laughs> Superman 64, I'm gonna play that on hard, by the way, when we get there. That fight went so well too. No back kick with Axel, you gotta do it the hard way. I think you can use the, uh, like the backhanded punch thing with Axel to do kind of the same thing. Time up. That's so stupid. 
No, not gonna be a 1cc. Mr. X is gonna take a lot of lives from me because he summons these little idiots over and over and they get in the way of the fight. Alright, let's get him. Good start. Really good start. Really, really good start. Yep, dead. That's all it takes. <laughs> all right, need to switch sides. I remember doing that as a kid. It's hurt pretty bad. A little bit more damage. Dude, we might win CC this. So close. Oh, crap, come on. Oh my god, one credit clear. One credit clear on hard. On the hardest. I was not expecting that. Wow, that was lucky. <laughs> I was just hoping to beat it, man. <laughs> Much less get that. One CC hardest mode clear. <laughs> okay, you know, you know what we have to do now? Now we have to beat Holy Diver Deathless and then finish level two of Ghosts and Goblins to complete the insanity for today then. Wow, I was not counting on that happening. <laughs> Mr. X fight went a lot better than I thought it would. He like if you like stay on the far side of the screen from him, he'll walk into you. And that worked pretty well. Totally unexpected, guys. Totally unexpected. I am surprised, Goober. I really am. Thanks for the GG's, guys. Holy crap. <laughs> Appreciate it very much. Uh, and now Axel and Adam and the police guy show up right here at the end after Blaze does, like, all the work. <laughs> Yeah, Booty, we're going to try Holy Diver Deathless. We made it to level 5 the other day. It's doable. We've done a 1cc run of it twice, so it's it's totally doable. It's probably not going to happen anytime soon, but it's something. It's going to be a long-term project. We're going to take a couple of runs at it maybe every streaming day and see what happens. But I think it's doable. I'm, I kind of know what I'm doing with it now. Again, guys, thanks for the GGs. I appreciate it, man. All right, so the last thing we're going to do with uh, this game is... Well, actually, we should do a 1cc with every character. Because <laughs> we just got it with Blaze. We might as well do it with Adam and Axel as well. All right, I'll add that to the list. Yeah, Cinny, I've done random games on stream before. It's fun. You never know what you're going to get. There's so many different games out there. Sometimes you may find a hidden gem and other times total garbage. But that's kind of the fun of it. But, but man, that went well. <laughs> That was shockingly effective right there. And there was a lot of stupid deaths, too. Like the time limit running out. Well, I don't know how I could have prevented that, but it happened. Uh, final fight would be easier. I think so. Final fight was easier to get a one credit clear on max difficulty than this, honestly. I did not think there was any shot at this. Well, there it is. Round ending. Well, I didn't put my name in. Who cares? Level hardest. There we go.